Hey, I'm back. I know it's been a couple months since I uploaded a camping video, but today I'm going camping, even though it looks like this out and it's cool, cold, threatening to snow. I am in Michigan. Anyhow, not a massive adventure, but that's okay. So I was at a conference all morning and I'm going to take the afternoon off and go camping at my friend's campground in Merrill, Michigan. And so I'm dressed like this because I was at the conference, not because I'm going camping. But no, I wasn't abducted from al by aliens. I've had a lot of stuff going on, some family stuff, some health stuff, some work stuff, and some other stuff. So anyhow, I need to clear that out so I can spend some time camping. Originally, I was going to ride my motorcycle today and then go camping. So it would have been a motorcycle camping trip. But then the forecast here in Michigan said snow. And I said, no, not doing that. But I did bring a tent and I think there's gonna be a campfire and just some good old times, even though it's cold and yucky here in Michigan. So yeah, I'm trying to go camping. If you see this, then I actually made it. But this is what I had to go through to get there crazy and I made it to the campground and I'm here with my friend uh, Jeff and he has his YouTube channel Subvet Jeff and he's on Facebook also and he is a motorcycle vlogger and so he's got a pretty cool channel he's just starting and we've got our fire going here tonight say hi Jeff how you doing there buddy all right man and we're gonna get uh, things going we've got a plan here let me show you we got the fire going, so I'm going to get a tent set up here tonight. And uh, Jeff lives here in this area and actually works here at this campground, so pretty cool. And we're going to have some burgers on the grill. And I am hoping that those clouds do not bring with them any more rain. There's been plenty. There's even been a little bit of sleet. But it's not going to damper things. You're lucky you missed the snow this afternoon. There was actually a little snow coming in when I got here this morning. Wow. All right, well, we got the uh, tent set up here. We got the fire going. We got some goodies out here. We're going to start uh, cooking supper. Let me show you the tent. Unlike a lot of places that show you glam tents, mine is not glamorous. It is a cot, a sleeping bag, a buddy heater, and yes, I have well ventilated and we are struggling with mother nature sending us some snow. All right, we're gonna get some more on here. We got some burgers and we got some onions on here. Let's see if we can get some more wood on here. You can tell he's done that before. Oh yeah. I have to take my fingers off. You got 10. Right. See, if I was good, I'd just go like that. <laughs> get some more over here so we can get the fire going better on this side. Yeah, so we got some Vidalia onions cooking there. Fortunately, we have a stash of mostly dry wood. Over there. <coughs> yeah, and you missed it. We had snow here a short while ago. Snow and sleet. Fun stuff. Yeah. <laughs> it is actually getting lighter now, isn't it? Yeah, it said it was, the sun might peak out around 8 o'clock. Just before it decides to go down. <laughs> right. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. You can hear all the birds, though. It's kind of nice to hear that. Our neighbor has a birdhouse right there. Cool. Good deal. So this is not rough camping. <laughs> this is almost glamping, but not quite since we're... Semi-glamping. Yeah. 
got a tent and actually eating food cooked over a fire. Can't beat this, so at least you're outside and enjoying the fresh, fresh air. So hopefully I can get my truck put back together. I got it all tore apart right now. Started building and then I got sick again. So yeah, I will get it done yet before at least the end of the summer. <laughs> but got some motorcycle trips to do and do probably a couple of them with Jeff. And yeah, I have this idea. I went past this off-road park. So I got a crazy idea about taking the truck, which is not really that great of an off. Well, it's four wheel drive and I've got big tires on it. So that qualifies me for doing something like at least I'll get stuck or break something. But I thought maybe that'd be kind of cool to do something like that. So I have to see off-road park kind of sounds like fun. All right, let's get uh, some flip, another flip, baby. See what we can do here. Oh my goodness, I found the smoke. And the smoke found me. I don't need to see. I can feel my way through the fire. All right. You get too hot, you're too close. <laughs> right. You got a big old Vidalia onion on here. I'm sure we're starting to smell the whole campground, stink the whole campground up with yeah. wonderful smells. Yeah, they love it. They're gonna be sorry they're not out here joining us. Yeah. What's better than the smell of grilled onions and hamburgers? Grilled steak and onions. Yeah, right. <laughs> there you go. There we go. Cool. See, we've got our meat and we've got our vegetables and my mom always told me to have my vegetables so there's the vegetables and the meat good stuff all right oh man we have some awesome food here check this out i got some burgers and onions and of course i doused it with ketchup and mustard because that's a staple at least for me and then it looks like Jeff has something else going on there. Oh yeah, Siraka, Siraka mayo, and then Miracle Whip. And uh, we got our vegetables on there too. So yeah, it's looking great. Good eats. Here, say it again. Thank you, Lord. Good food, good company, good eats. Thank you, Lord. Amen. And yeah, it's starting to get dark out, but boy, that fire looks good. I want to work anyway. We're hanging out here around the fire. Got it cranked up a bit. It's cold. So, she's enjoying the evening. Good deal. Well, Jeff got a new motorcycle. New yeah. to me. New to him, yeah. You guys can't. He's got a pretty cool, what is it, 2000 model? It's the longest named motorcycle in the world. <laughs> it's a 2000. Yamaha Royal Star Adventure Limited Millennial Edition. Wow. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Yeah. So it's a cruiser bike and it is an awesome looking bike. So hopefully we'll get to see him out there on doing some traveling on it. And uh, if he has the opportunity to go, let me flip this around here. I'll uh, post a link to his video then and you get to see it. So it'll be fun. Hopefully we'll get out there. I got a little repair to do with the Goldwing before it goes out. But uh, I have access to another Goldwing, so I might take that one. Have some fun. But tonight, it's cold weather camping <laughs> in Michigan when it's supposed to be warm. We had our 83 degree day last Saturday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. One day of summer. Yeah, one day of summer to tempt you. So it won't be too long. It's about bedtime. I'm going to head to bed. It is almost time to head to bed. Got in here in the tent, got things zipped up, and got the heater going. Really 
warming up quite a bit in here. So man, it is so cold outside. It's got to be 25 degrees, maybe 30 at the most, but it's a great evening anyhow. Wasn't exactly what I'd planned on. Looking for a nice warmer day, spring day, but hey, at least I'm out camping. Good morning. It's 30 degrees out. The birds are singing. It's starting to get light. And I'm toasty warm in here. Well, that was a pretty good night, actually. It uh, rained or snowed or sleeted or whatever it did all night. I guess it probably was it was uh, snow or sleet because it's only 30 degrees right now. We got the heater on this morning warming up. But uh, I got to go find the little boy's room, and it's not uh, just a real close here. So I'm going to go do that and come back and try and get things together here. Get around. I got to pack up and I got about a two hour drive home today. So let me see what we can do. I'm getting pretty close to having everything packed up. Just got to take the tent down yet and get the cot put back in its bag. So hopefully, we'll be on the road here soon.